you drive your truck through a through a building, you bring a gun to school. These are things communities need to know about. Now, if you want to withhold names, that's what we do by policy anyways. But that information of how and why it happened, that's how communities know when they need to push on school boards to do better or city councils or police departments or their mental health services or the people who are in charge of their drug and alcohol prevention programs. Communities don't know whether those places are getting the job done unless we do report on the bad incidents that happen. And it's tough. In those situations, while they're kids, those are extreme situations. And they those kids, unfortunately, made very adult decisions. And at that point, while we would never reveal their names, I think those were two very public situations that affected a lot of people.